Okay. Net neutrality rules rolling back. The FCC voted to repeal the Obama era regulations in December, but it goes into effect today. Yeah, the rules required online service providers to treat all internet traffic the same. Wish TV's Anna Warnicky has more on what the changes will mean. Starting Monday, internet providers don't have to treat all web traffic equally. The FCC is rolling net neutrality back. That means large companies like Comcast and Verizon can now speed up, slow down, or block specific websites or online services. If they can start changing their pricing structures. Political analyst Gary Nordlinger says these new rules could affect the way internet providers do business. I mean, that's one of the big fears. If you want to have access to Facebook and uh, LinkedIn and some of these others, are they going to charge you a social media surcharge? I, we just don't know. FCC Chairman Ajit Pai says the new rules, known as Restoring Internet Freedom Order, will provide unrestricted access to online content minus the burden of regulation. I don't think it'll be really very different. Baron Soka with Tech Freedom says the internet was free and open before net neutrality, and it will continue to stay that way. The internet will be just fine. The free and open internet has never really been in danger. But Jay Stanley with the American Civil Liberties Union says the new rules give internet providers too much power to control competitors. Taking away network neutrality protections means that we're giving freedom to these big monopolistic internet and cable companies to mess with your internet content. They can change how fast your content arrives. They can block certain content. Stanley says the fight to keep the old rules isn't over. The Senate passed a bill in May to keep net neutrality. The bill is still waiting on a vote in the House. In Washington, I'm Anna Warnicke.